Hello friends, this is Umesh and here in this video, I would show you how to uh, enable the Wi-Fi. I mean, how to set up the Wi-Fi network on your Raspberry Pi 3 because Raspberry Pi 3 Model B has the onboard uh, Wi-Fi. So let's enter into Raspberry Pi on 92.168.1.6. This is my IP address. It might be different in your case, but just enter into your Raspberry Pi. Just put the username and the password. Okay. So right now I'm into Raspberry Pi. So it is always good, good practice if you are doing it first or second time, if you are booting your Raspberry Pi once or twice uh, since you have bought your Raspberry Pi. Okay, so it's a good practice to update the packages. So run sudo app get update. Okay, this might take a couple of minutes, but um, it's okay. It's a good practice to, uh, you know, a couple of minutes and save the pain for the future. Okay, so just hold on for a second or minutes and uh, we will be ready okay let's run so let me clear the screen by running a command clear okay and now we have the fresh new window okay anyways uh, so to set up the network we have to set the network credential so if you look at my uh, wi-fi my internet you can see i'm using ut starcom and that's where my wi-fi is connected to so i have to set the network credential for the wi-fi that i have at my home so to set the network credential uh, through the command prompt we have to you know edit a specific file so let me show you how to get this file and how to edit the file so you have to type sudo nano sorry nano this is the editor uh, etc wps supplicant wps supplicant dot config so this is a file where we have to add our network credentials so let's enter into the file so when you enter into file you just see three or four lines what you have to do is you have to add the network credential your network credential into uh, this file so let me add my network credential so ssid is UT Starcom in my case, this is the password. It's a random number. I just trust on you that you would not do any malicious stuff with my system. Anyways, I just exposed my network. Anyways, that's not so important. So this is what you have to do. You have to put your network credential, your SSID and password and the type of key that you use for uh, the security. So what you have to do is just save the file. So hit Control O. Okay, and it will ask you to write and hit enter. Okay, now it's safe and then uh, press control X so it will take you back and um, What you can do is right now your network credential is set Okay, so you need not have to do anything with apart from this one now when you just type sudo and reboot So next time when you reboot your Raspberry Pi, okay, so just run the command sudo reboot and it will reboot your Raspberry Pi Okay, that's okay with raspberry pi it shows something like this but that's absolutely fine so when you reboot you can see on your raspberry pi the led is not blinking and start blinking back again so it means your system is rebooting so what i gonna do right now i just close because the session is already closed so let me close this things and what i would like to do is i would like to go and disconnect lan cable from my raspberry pi so let me do this so right now it is uh, disconnected, the LAN cable is disconnected. So what I would gonna do is I just open up the, because it's rebooting and uh, Raspberry Pi doesn't take so much of time to reboot. So let me go back into my router and look at the IP address of my Raspberry Pi. Okay, right now I'm inside of the Pi and in the DHCP listing, I hope I would get, and I, I think if you remember when I log in first time, I used this uh, 192.168.1.6. Uh, that's where my router is connected to because it holds the past history. I just believe that this one, this is new one, Raspberry, it's the same host name, Raspberry Pi, Raspberry Pi. And I think this would be the newer IP address that I have. So let me copy this, okay? And let me go back into the SSH client. Okay, let me put in here and let me see if I can log in. If I log in, that means my Wi-Fi is set up on my Raspberry Pi. So let me hit open. Okay, and oh, it's a bad luck. It shows some kind of problems, but that's okay. It okay. So it takes a couple of minutes. Maybe it's because it's the fresh new that we have set it up. Wi-Fi set up. Anyways, the login name is a Pi back again. And the password is raspberry here. And let me go inside of the 
Raspberry Pi. So this is it. Right now, you can take your Raspberry Pi in your hand and your laptop, have a cup of coffee and sit into the garden and have a fun. Okay, that's it. I hope you will find this video educational and entertaining. Keep watching this video and feel free to subscribe. If you have any question, put down in the YouTube description box. Okay, thank you very much. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.